say that a couple of times all right hey what's up it's hovelados as always turn this music up a little bit 10 percent is probably cool um put the mass at 100 music at 10 maybe i don't know um <clears throat> so i'm going to turn off the wireless controller speaker um yeah so i'm playing van helsing which is a pc as video game on the PC, uh, ps4 i just picked this up during the, the double um double discount sale for about five dollars i think maybe, maybe uh more like four um yeah so i checked online couldn't find any reviews for it for ps4 and uh mm, that's gonna be a problem move this a little bit um couldn't find any reviews for it on the ps4 oh shoot i'm right in the middle of my freaking um okay yellow substance is your <clears throat> your rage resource you can enhance your attack if you press l1 or use r to set up power-ups when you hit your maximum range the light bar the light bar on huh? ah you got scrolled on <laughs> when the controller will start pulsing in yellow huh. well I can't see it because I'm looking up <laughs> alright so that is actually the the um, map that I'm over right now so I'm going to see if I can move this you know what? I might just turn off my face altogether. Let's see. I know. Say goodbye to this beautiful face, says Jovan. Alright, okay. Uh, broadcast settings. And settings. Camera. Uh, include video. Nope. Alright, so we got rid of that camera. This way I could see the see the everything. I should wait for that thing to clear up before I uh, start fighting. But right now, basically like I said, a PC has a game for the, the PS4. So, basically I just spam the attack. Literally, literally. Good stuff. So if you're nostalgic for old PC games, man... I don't know if that uh if that really um if this is given a good uh um there are a lot of settings on on this which also makes you feel like it's a PC game. Uh let's turn that master down a little bit. It did seem to be a little loud to me. Um So yeah, this is my companion right here. I forget her name. She's a ghost. All right, cool. Frozen. Oh, I guess I like it. Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't have enough mana. All right, so I'll use all my mana. Missed them every time. I wonder if there's a a button that allows you to lock on. What's up? What's up? I don't know who just joined in, but hey, I am playing a piece of game right now for the whole Some healing potions would be nice. Alright, so let's go before I die. Companion death. <laughs> she falls in a weakened state for a short time while weakened her passive skills still provide bonuses. Okay. Well, I am going to be a coward and run away. Oh, there she goes. Oh, she's with me, though. All right, so let's, let's, let's get going. Oh, no. Oh, yep. All right, I left. Um, so 
so depending on how this goes I'm gonna stick with this for a second or I might switch back over to um because I was planning on playing Skullgirls but I might save that for tomorrow now this is a town I just left ain't it looks like it find the find the mayor of the village oh no Okay, so I guess I was, I left the village too soon. Oops, didn't mean to let you get that. So I could buy stuff here now. Uh, do I have money enough? No, I don't have any money. All right, let's leave this merchant. You can sell items to the merchant. Oh, so maybe I should sell something. Excuse me. These things have higher DPS. I should actually be switching my. Uh... Oh, I got a vil. So last time I played, it said that I had points to use, but I kept on trying to use them and they wouldn't pop up. So as always, oh, willpower. Let's put on that. Body always. Luck always. And one for dexterity. Right, let's see if there's anything else. Statistics, whatever. Oh yeah, my dude's name is Crab Cake. Don't ask me why. Alright. So everything here is going to be stronger. It's just the one that I have right now equipped seems like it has... Um, parry is 25%. 13. I'm gonna use a great sword. That sounds like Zelda type, you know. All right, let's see. Oh, wrong button. There it goes. Square. Let's see, how do I find this mayor? Objectives. Find the mayor. The mayor hasn't returned to the. Fi oh, oops. So I gotta go find him in the woods. Wander Romany. Put a curse on the village alchemist. I need uh, his services. So I have to talk to the travelers first. Talk to Romany. Romany. All right. I don't know. Where's the Romany leader? Storekeeper. I'm not, not even drunk. I'm just resting. Boy, okay. stop bothering me. This is, this is a full of stars. Captain somebody. Hmm. Ah, gotta follow the paths. Those are clearly streets. I mean, straight up, this is, uh, I, this thing makes me feel real, uh... I think we need all three. Whatever that's missing from here. Ah. He doesn't talk. Alright, so let's just leave the village again. Let's, let's get, let's get this action popping. Come on. Oh, so triangle I could have healed. And, uh, circle would have done something, too. So I was just watching a video about CERN's ambitious plan to build the largest particle smasher ever. And I know this is kind of off topic, but like, hey, we're trying to open up dimensions to other universes, which brings me to another thing, right? So yesterday I saw the, um, yesterday I saw, um, Death Stranding. Oh, nice. I saw the Death Stranding um, uh, new trailer and had me thinking. First, it had me thinking that I think the game is trash. That's just how I feel. Um, but I've never played it, so like that's based on what, right? Um, but requires level five. All right, so this is what I got. 
Defense six, keep that. Um. So uh, it had me thinking, like, yo, what type of random? I don't have enough mana. That little shock helped out. Um. So yeah, as I'm watching the trailer, I'm looking at it like this is like it has to do with alternate universes and stuff. I wonder if I have a limit on what I can carry in my inventory. Anyway, um, yeah, oh, pulverizer, pulverized discharger. Ooh, that sounds good. Gave that to the companion. All right. I guess I can't equip it. Okay. Yeah. Gave our gun. Um. Got a couple of different type of pistols. I know I'm getting lost in the sauce. Let's put it back on the blunderbuss. All right. Um. Oh yeah, yeah. So as I'm watching it, I'm like, yo, this kind of looks like. It may have to do with alternate dimensions and stuff because I saw something about breach. Oh shit! I need healing potions. Take out the entire army. Nah, son. Keep up all the hostile behavior. That was dope. Oh, a gruesome puzzle. Let me see. The wagon was attacked by the soldiers. And werewolves. No, the distribution of the paw prints is all wrong. They just rushed in and out. Did you just say distribution? And this track here? Is deeper. The you know what I find funny about this? I've been seeing this game up As there you should be. every right. year for like the past Let's three go years. Find for us like a werewolf hovering now. around three dollars, four dollars when it goes on sale, and I never pick it up. I'm actually pretty glad that I did, man. This is this is enjoyable to me. It may sh show my my nerditude or something like that, but which is a good thing nowadays. Wasn't when uh, wasn't back in the day. You know what I'm saying? Ah, uh, get it. Oh. Take that. Oh. That's like a. What are those things called? What was Mr. Tumnus? I forget. How do I fire my gun? I forgot. Ah, there we go. L3 lets me switch. Um, Alright, so yeah. I'm thinking it's about alternate dimensions. Because, like... Alright, there we go. Hey, I'm hitting you with a blunderbuss. Uh, alternate dimensions. I saw something about breach babies. Um, what was the thing about br um, bridges or something like that? Like that's the name of the company. And it was like the United States of America in all black, right? It was the same map, but the United States was in all black. So I feel like they're telling us a lot and uh, and and also not much at all. Um, I uh, really. I really think it looks it, like it would be an awesome movie. I don't know how it's going to do as a game. It's the type of game that I think I would Last, only watch people do. With proper like, watch people play. Get me out of this unholy forest alive, and I will be grateful. I'm afraid I can't do that. My path leads me straight to the heart of darkness. Mm, right. Uh, to the darkness, then. Could you at least escort me to the Romany camp? Totally can, dude. I could, yes. I could do that, yes. Oh, yeah, this is straight up like real RPG. You know what I mean, I get to make choices, dialogue. Man, is this what I've been looking for the whole time? Right. 
Mana potion. Oh, oh! So I literally. Oh, I doubled oh, the number of altar. ghosts. Maybe we shouldn't go too close. You don't okay. have to worry. You're bound to me. Sacred places only affect wandering ghosts. Okay, I'll take that. I mean, does that mean something's gonna fight me though? All right, where do I need to go? Oh, I gotta get him this way. All right, you know what? Let's go through the area that I've already killed everybody off. I'm pretty sure this was supposed to be an obstacle on the way that was taking him out. But... Alright, let's see if there's any weapons to switch up, any points. Ooh, available skills. Passive skill, let's add that. What's that? Parry expertise. Nice. Okay. Um, now what's this? Bash. Enhances melee weapon damage and makes targets um, more vulnerable to further attacks. 10 to 17 physical damage. Ooh, you know what? I'm forgetting about that. Um about to call it Yoba Goya. Um, a freaking... I don't know if that's going to strike. Let's level that up. Precise strike attack ignores 30% of enemy physical resistance and does 20% more damage. Stunning strike stuns enemy for one second. Heavy strike 50% melee damage. I'm going to do this. Ignore... Cause you know what, when people start getting armor and stuff, that's that's the stuff that like slows down your whole um, interaction as far as like taking them out and everything. Oops. All right, let's see. Um, no new that. Let's see, guns. I know I saw a new gun. Try that. Can I do that? Oh, I have to give that to the companion. All right. Well, she has double guns, I guess. Uh, hmm. I am level four. I think required level four. Let's see. This is the same as this one. Equipped. Eight to thirteen. Thirteen to seventeen. Yeah, I'll do that one. Musket. The armor. Let's change that armor out if it. Oh no, for this one, it's the highest defense. Hat. Cloak. Hmm. Less protection. Okay. Uh, I wonder if this stuff makes you look different, because that, that's. That's a real dope shit. I mean, this makes me want to play Mass Effect again now. Ooh, I might even, if I have enough time, I might even throw that on, but I'm not going to. It's 118. Let's see. All right. Gloves. All right, I might need to sell that. See, boots. Level 7 required. Switch to that. Oh, it's minus two. That's plus ten protection. Defense four. Plus six. Changes if equipped. Okay, so it's saying. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. All right, so I am making my dude stronger through this. I uh, got that ring. Healing potion. Mana potion or what is this? Magic essence. Hmm. Just can't use that unless I have an essence magic weapon on. Let's see. It's good. Healing potion's good. And then uh, weapons. I got the bastard sword and great sword. 
Use that great sword straight up. All right, we're next. We got some people coming. Let's keep running. Let's keep going. Oh no! More mana needed. Okay, we're killing them. Here. Got him. Heavy cape. Ooh, so this might actually... Man, I'm loving this. The loot grind, man. Getting this loot. Alright, available skills. So, she has two points left. Stroke of Terror. Adds 6.5% paralyzed chance to her attacks. Alright, and this one... Alright, to my defense. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Let's add body, luck, willpower, dexterity. I should probably add to him. But you know what? I need to start giving my dude dexterity. That's what it is. Oh, wait, did I even switch that thing? Uh, darn, I didn't. Inventory. What did I just pick up? It was. Heavy cape. There we go. Defense 20. This is definitely the way to go. Oh, requires level 6. So I got to keep on leveling up. I pick up anything else. Nope. Alright. Alright, oh, Harpy's still there. Take that. Ooh. Nice. I need healing potions. I can't do that. You can't heal? Shit. Let's see. Do I have a actual potion? I don't have any more healing potions. Heal. My man over here straight. Almost got him back. <laughs> Fuck, I died. <sighs> I respawn. Okay. of wisdom. Oh shit, I made three of them. I don't even know how many of them. My backpack is full. Oh shit, for real? Alright, so two of them disappeared. Um... <laughs> Some healing potions would be nice. I like this shit. I'm kiting. Like it's supposed to do. Throw it back. Ooh, level up. Nice. 
Not mm. enough space. All right, so that means, damn, of course there's uh, limits on the inventory. All right, so we got, so we got some shit here. We gotta drop, we'll drop that. Drop that. Drop that. I can use that, not drop that. Right, let's see. Drop that. Drop that. Alright. Let's see anything else worth dropping. Drop. And drop. We could, we could, we could. Let's see, what's the time up on like? Alright, so I could pick up the fire scarab. So let's see what that fire scarab is. Skills. Inventory, there we go. Fire scarab thing. Ah, spell cuffs. Ah, oh, can't even use that. But I could sell it, so I'm gonna hold on to it. All right, we're almost there. Not possible. It's not possible. So good. there Romany camp got there exactly where he needed to be Yeah, so Death Stranding, I was talking about Death Stranding. Uh, Death Stranding looks like it's going to be um, some interesting stuff going on. All right, let's see. Did I, did I get them there? Um, Escort Merchant. Right. Is he still with me? Where do I need to go now? But, uh, did I run back to the place where I started off? I don't make no sense. Alright. You know what? Having so much fun. I'm about to stop right quick. I said Death Stranding like 800 times. Oh, I just noticed her, her pictures up top. Alright. So, I'm going to end it here. Hope you enjoyed my rambling and not staying focused on the thing i'm gonna probably change the name on the stream because i think i just threw the name up but uh i'll get a good one and hopefully you enjoy this as much as if i as i did um what's it called if if you're looking for something inexpensive that gives you that nostalgic pc um play without a mouse you gotta use it i mean the only thing yeah it's no mouse you're using a um controller but it actually controls very well 
Um, I know what I heard is that people are very confused by the menus. I mean, just take a little time and read it. It's a little daunting, but you know what? It's something for me. It's something fulfilling and great about all these extra menus and systems and everything. And knowing that the choices you make actually affect the character. If I have a, if I have a chance, I'm going to throw in Mass Effect and play that uh, again for a little second. Um, still haven't finished that. I got a lot of games I got to finish. And that's actually why I made the backlog backlog boys thing but you know uh hopefully in the coming months i'm gonna get a little more structured maybe um maybe take down some stuff change some stuff up or leave it all up but i want to like kind of relaunch this whole thing and make it a little more profesh but that's gonna be after i get into the house which i assume i'm gonna have so much time to do stuff once i get there oh yeah and i'm back to my village i think i messed up i think i messed up unless everywhere has a storage uh let's see inventory Put that in there. Put that in there. Be heavy. This could go in there. It's not level six yet. That could go in there. That could go in there. But yeah, um, I'm really enjoying this. If you have any love for like old, older, um. PC RPGs and stuff. This is actually pretty cool. I mean, I've heard nothing like I didn't hear any reviews for it for the PS4. It seemed like it went without anyone noticing it even existed, I guess, because of Diablo and stuff. But, um, you know, never, as, as a person who's never played Diablo, I actually enjoyed this a little bit. Anyway, uh, hopefully, you could catch it before it goes off sale. Like I said, it, I think I got it for like three dollars, four dollars, enhanced edition. That, um, uh, Van Helsing 2 is actually cheaper, and I'm going to resist and listen to my better angels. I'm not going to buy Van Helsing 2 until I've actually finished this one. There's no reason to jump on the next one. I heard the next one has better systems, um, but it's more like tower defense or something like that. I don't know uh, if that even makes sense. But uh, yeah, y'all have a good one. About to be out. Get back to work. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And if you don't, it's cool. As long as you enjoy, I enjoy it. You know what I mean?